what's up guys welcome back to my channel my name is vicky you guys please if you've been watching my video try and subscribe like this video and let us have this relationship you please leave your comment in the comment section let's just talk about this this big brother thing that has been going on okay in this particular video is just me coming to you guys to gist people in and checks altercation you understand so the housemate they actually have had like a cooking competition so after the competition they came inside the house and you have guys already know how the islanders are always talking about the trenches like the house one always talking down on the house too you know the house one they really have like a big problem with the house too like they see them as enemy they i don't even understand you guys so actually the uh, chichi was actually talking and asking why are they always dressed as if they are going for a party or they are going for some serious occasion you understand it was just trying to talk down on her and doing was just telling them that they should calm down that they can all be classy in their competition they can all be you know matured about the way they compete not just trying to see them as an enemy you understand and already Shex and Doyin had this conversation where Doyin was just, as in Shex was always saying that they should swap a Doyin, maybe take somebody up, uh, take Doyin up and bring somebody down and, and, and all that, you understand? And Doyin said that she actually told Shex that she does not like that kind of statement, you understand? So when they were having this conversation in the dining about house, one talking about house two, you understand? Shex, and maybe she coming to their defense, Shex repeated it there and was like they should swap you they should swap you and she was like she does not like it and then she walks to the kitchen you understand and then she was having a conversation with Deji and was just talking about them being classy and all that and then she left the dining and went to the kitchen and was just saying classy 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 according to her she said she actually did not say anything to her you get to him you understand she went into the room and was lying down on her bed you guys um Shags now went into their room and she, according to her, seeing Shex entering the room, she told, she just categorically told Shex that, please, I'm not ready for a conversation with you. And Shex was like, who is coming to have like a conversation with you? I'm, I'm, I, who, who told you I'm coming to have a conversation with you? And she was like, she does not want to talk to him, you guys. And Shex walks to, towards her bed, close to Alison's bed. And then he was like, okay, this is not Bella's bed. You understand? And then Shex just went off. Shex started insulting, started abusing, um, doing, calling doing names, thinking that she's too, saying that she's too full of herself, that she's this, she just, that she's a fool, she's stupid started calling her names and i was like shakes we know the same guy that was telling elo swag not to talk back at bella like what kind of two-edged sword are you you know two-faced are you you get you just spoke to a, another guy just yesterday telling the guy that the guy should not talk to your lady or when a lady is talking or angry you shouldn't be angry and you're the one that just went off completely on doing calling her name saying all manner of things she he really said a lot to doing you understand and we don't even know where that was coming from my my, my own is that he's just been a two-faced and he was just condescending you get and i don't understand how he went up like that but this is me now addressing it from my own point of view do you get doing it actually like like i really i'm, I'm feeling her right now i know yesterday i was saying that doing is hunting for a man is hustling for a man yes maybe she's put she's coming off that way to us you understand but to be really honest with you i like the way doing it's actually relating with the other housemates in level two you get you don't necessarily have to be enemies with the other housemates you people don't have to be enemies yes you are competitors yes you are an opponent you understand but you don't have to be an enemy you get and these people are going as far as forgetting that this game is a one-man game now only one person that ain't go win this 100 million naira so you now creating and forming enmity to the other half of the team not knowing that there is life outside here even if you know win or you even win you understand i think there can be a healthy you know um competition and not the one the, the housemates are always always if you hear the way the, the 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 house one are talking about the house too you will just feel like these people 
are basically saying that people in house two are their enemies and you realize that if you hear house two talking about house one you know that they are talking about their competitor not their enemy you understand and then yesterday when they were having their conversation they were having their sorry their wager tax uh, game you understand when people that ask Sheikh to come and you know give an opinion i am um, criticizing what house two actually did he came and he said things condescending and then big brother asked house two if they had if they have what to say you get even though some of the housemates in house two was like you no know, make no talk anything that kind of a thing but beauty still came out and was just trying to put a point when they came inside chomzi was now saying that beauty is blind is it that blind one that one that's always wearing glasses she's blind i don't know is was that I don't feel I don't feel is necessary. I don't feel that the enmity they are trying to create among themselves is necessary. And to be really honest with you, in this case, I stand on you because she is the only one that is understanding that at the end of this day, at the end of the day, this game is a one man show and on one and one person go win and because she was telling Bella when she was explaining what happened between Shakes and herself, she told Bella that you forget that. After every after this whole drama, we will still be coming up against ourselves. And that's just the honest truth, you understand? I think she's the only one that is understanding that at this point, even if we finish fighting the house, two people, we will still come back to ourselves to start biting ourselves so that one winner will emerge. So the whole drama, and then Bella took it to go and tell... Bella now said that, okay, she came to talk to her because she heard her name, you understand? Because during the uh, um, arguments, which she kept... She, Bella heard when um, Donnie was telling Shex that this is not Bella Bella. And Bella was like, that's why she came to ask her what actually happened, that she doesn't want her name to be mentioned in a case that's consigning Shex, that Shex is an indiv individual of his own. He has his own name, blah, 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 and all that. That he, She's going to talk to Shex, that Shex shouldn't have insulted her. And then Bella went, instead of to carry Shex, come on from where other housemates, the likes of Chomzi, the likes of Chichi, um, Hermes, um, Deji, we are there. Instead of she to excuse Sheikhs from there, she went and sat down there and addressed the issue, making them attack her. Now they are making it, they are now saying that the reason why she was angry at Sheikhs is because she actually likes Sheikhs, that she knows that that's where it's coming from. Instead of you to explain, see reasons with her. Everybody has a way they address things or a way they react to things, you understand? Instead of to be, to, 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 Tell your guys, say, oh my, what thing you do day wrong if you're not going to abuse her? Now you're saying the reason why she will, she is angry is because she likes shakes. Like, these two matter not just concern each other, you understand? So I just feel like the way the islanders are taking the, the trenches is not it at all. I just feel like they can be an, a, healthy, a healthy competition without enmity because they are taking it way, way, way too personal. And I just feel like maybe that's the aim of a big brother at the end of the day because um, the way these housemates, they, they go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth with their, themselves, I don't think it's really healthy because reunion go, go, like re, re, reunion will be so, so, so dramatic. You get So that's just it, guys. I just felt like, let me come and say, what are your thoughts? Like, do you feel like the way the Islanders or the way House 1 are taking House 2, is it necessary? The way they react, the way the name calling and the way they are seeing them like their enemy, is it okay? To me, my judgment is, I feel like they can be a, a healthy competition without trying to be enemies. We can still be friends, but be competitors, you understand? That's just how I see it. So what are your thoughts, guys? Leave it in the comment section. Thank you so very much for watching. I will most definitely see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.